Six trucks have been torched on the N3 at Van Rienen Pass in the early hours of this morning. It's believed the trucks were set alight by a group of unknown arsonists who then fled the scene. The motive for the attack on the trucks remains unknown. Authorities and emergency services are on the scene and cleanup uh, and recovery operations are currently underway and every effort is being made to reopen the N3 toll route as soon as it is safe to do so. Road users are advised to delay their travels to the area until further notice. And on the line to us uh, to talk about this is N3 toll concession operations manager Tanya Dugra, who says currently the highway is closed to traffic. A very good morning to you, Tanya. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, just tell us uh, what exactly happened. Well, shortly before 1 a.m. this morning, um, arsonists set alight heavy vehicles and their loads. There were six vehicles that were impacted by the incident. And unfortunately, as a result of that, as you just said, the entirety of the Renan Pass has been closed to traffic in both a north and a southbound direction. We are advising motorists to please continue to delay travel to the area until further notice. The recovery and cleanup operations are underway, but as soon as they've um, cleared off the, the debris of the vehicles, our engineering team will be able to assess the damage to the road surface and any emergency repairs that are required before we can reopen to traffic because obviously we need to ensure that it's safe for our motorists before we do so. Tanya, has the motive for, uh, uh, for such arson been established as yet? Not that I'm aware of. What are the police saying? Um, well, they are busy investigating the incident. Obviously, it is an active crime scene, uh, but we have not received any further reports or feedback from them at this stage. Were the trucks stationary when they were torched? The reports that we received was that the, the drivers were forced to stop the vehicles, which okay. were then set alight by the arsonists, yes. All right. Has there any been uh, uh, reported incidents of uh, maybe uh, loss of life or injuries? I'm very happy to report that fortunately there were no injuries sustained during this incident. Okay. C can you confirm that the highway is still closed and motorists should use alternative routes? At this point in time, yes, the highway is still closed in the vicinity of Van Rienen Pass. Um, and we are advising that motorists should please delay the travel to the area. I unfortunately can't advise about the state of any of the alternative routes at this point in time. And so, and hence, as I said, it's best that they please delay their travel to the area if at all possible. So you can't tell m motorists which other alternative routes to use? Maybe, uh, you know, the, w w we just got this advisory now. No, well, look, unfortunately, it's really difficult for us to advise about the state of alternative routes. We, we are primarily involved only with the entry toll route itself. Um, I am aware that, you know, there are other routes which are not necessarily in a state to be able to support heavy vehicle travel, for example. So that makes it extremely difficult mm. for those route users to, to attempt to use those routes because it would not be possible. Um, you know, the incident did occur in the early hours of this morning and we have been issuing advisories throughout the course of the day already. Uh, I know that it's inconvenient. And we are working really hard to open the roadway as soon as possible. Okay, I know that it may be, uh, it may be very difficult to establish at this point, but uh, uh, what's the estimated time for the mop-up operations? Look, as I said, the recovery and cleanup operations are currently underway. Okay. Uh, we are attempting to reopen at least part of the highway to get traffic to move through as soon as possible, but that is very much dependent on any emergency repairs that need to be carried out. We don't want to expose anyone to any dangerous driving conditions. Mm. All right, Tanya, great chatting to you. Thank you so much for that update. Okay, thank you.